Welcome back everyone, my name is Echo and I hope you're having a great day. Today's YouTube video is a little bit different because today in this video I'm going to be unboxing and showing you guys the Honor 20. Now a big thank you to Huawei for sending this out to me. I think this is the first phone I've actually unboxed and showcased on my YouTube channel. Now there'll be a couple links down below so where you guys can check this out for yourself. I do want to mention I was not paid to make today's video. However, I was sent the Honor 20 for free. So this is a pretty low budget mobile gaming device, which I think is going to have a lot of power. So let's get into this. The first thing we need to do here, get my trusty knife and open this thing fully, and I want to do the first experience on my channel. But I want to know in the comments section, for those who do game with a phone, what phone are you using? Or do you game with like a tablet? I love the first opening of this. So you can see the, a, a couple of specs there. So you've got Honor 20, it's 128 gigabyte, and it's six gigabyte of RAM. The color is midnight black that I'm using today. Okay, so let's take off the lid of the box and see what's underneath. Midnight black. I usually do purchase a black phone anyway. I think it does come in a different range of colors. You got a different set of colors on the front here. Um, but this is, wow, this is actually a lot bigger than I thought it was gonna be. Hi there guys. So this is a, a lot bigger. I'm used to gaming, well, mobile gaming on a tablet, uh, but I have big hands. So this is gonna be the perfect device for me. Let's have a little look at this phone, shall we? All right, so this thing is locking fresh. What about the back actually? So the back, it just says on a 20. Obviously this is like a, a reviewed product, which is why it says not for sale there. It also said not for sale on the box as well. Uh, we're gonna take this off, of course we are. Now I'm not just saying this because I was sent this phone, but the interface and this phone in general, it is absolutely beautiful. I love the whole finish around the outside. But one thing I was thinking is that it's glass on the back and obviously glass on the front. It did have one protective cover on the front. I've taken it off, but I think it also has another one. I'm not gonna take that off because I'm fine with keeping at least one of them to protect the screen. And I was like, I would probably purchase myself a phone cover for this. You don't need to because after inspecting the box, it comes with charging ports. One of them's currently in my PC right now, which is this one because it needed a little bit of charge. Um, yeah, this box here, obviously this would be used for your SIM card, but it actually comes with a free case. I've noticed though, I, I do get a lot of smudge, smudge marks on the back of this. No, dude, it comes with its own case. I am usually an iPhone user, and the size difference, dude. Man, I love a bigger phone. Why I've not purchased a bigger phone, I don't know why. I am gonna absolutely love this. All right, let's turn this on and let's go through a little bit more. So I went ahead and installed a couple of apps, been messing around with a couple of games, one of them being Minecraft, one of them being Pixelgun 3D, and another one being Fortnite, because if you don't know, the Honor 20 actually comes with an exclusive skin, and that's the Honor Wonder Fortnite outfit. I will show you guys some gameplay in a little bit. Something else I do wanna mention is that this device supports 60 FPS on a bunch of games. Something else I'm also enjoying about this, guys, is like the black bars around the outside. I, I don't know why, but usually when I'm gaming, I find myself touching the sides quite a lot, sometimes firing bullets by mistake if it's Pixel Gun 3D, or sometimes uh, digging by mistake. Now, I do have big hands, and this fits absolutely perfect. I love it. Now, something else that this thing does have is it does come with uh, built-in recording, so you aren't gonna need an app in order to record some gameplay. I believe it's this app right there, which is called Screen Recorder. All I had to do was slide down the top of the screen and it gives me the ability to record it. So usually if I'm gaming, what I need to do um, to record, especially for Android devices, if I'm recording my Android device, I usually need this wire. So this will go into a HDMI, HDMI cable and this will go into the device. Now, I still have that option available, so if I really wanted to, I could still put this inside of here. Um, it's just where, obviously, your charging port would go. If I show you guys real quick, this is usually how I record my devices, being Android. I would have to do this. I don't have to do this because I can record in-game. So I'm gonna record a little bit of footage of Minecraft, of Pixelgun 3D, and hopefully of Fortnite and show you guys the overall quality with the in-built recording option. All right then guys, so the audio you currently hear is the microphone from the built-in phone. 
Also, the gameplay you're currently seeing, I'm recording this with the in-game recording option, which I've already showed you where that is. Um, I just kind of want to test the power of this. And what we're going to do is we're going to start Minecraft with its default settings. Usually Minecraft kind of caters to the specific devices, down to chunks, down to beautiful skies, on or off, rendering clouds, etc. So we're just going to get a play. We're going to simply create ourselves a brand new world. I also do want to mention that you do have the option to turn the microphone on or off, but I wanted to show you how good the quality actually is. So we're just going to put this in survive for the sake of this one, starting map, bonus chest, and let's load this up. So it looks like by default, when I load this up, on the Honor 20 Pro. It doesn't have clouds enabled, and I think we're at 16 chunks, which I think is by default. So we're gonna bump this up and we're just gonna do a little bit of exploring. I, I basically wanna see if this causes any lag. I also wanna see um, if my phone gets hot. Of course, nobody wants a hot phone. It's just not comfortable for you as a gamer. So we've got a video. I'm gonna change this to beautiful skies. We're gonna uh, keep them on. Fancy bubbles, I'd have to back out, but that's not too much of a problem. And yeah, 16 chunks by default. So this goes up to 24. And with Minecraft, it looks like Minecraft settings are different on different devices. Like my iPad Pro, I think it was up to like 80 chunks, um, which is understandable because that's a really high-end tablet. I don't seem to be having any problems at all. Sometimes chunk loading can be a pain on this one. Um, I think having a lot of memories and, and a decent RAM on this phone is pretty good. Um, I'm hoping I'm not covering the audio ports as well. Like I don't want to have to hold my phone in a specific way and the audio not be picked up correctly or if I cover it and it's going to be like muffled kind of sound. Uh, but I'm not having any lag issues and hopefully you guys can see that on this gameplay recording. I'm just going to grab myself some of these things as well. This is the free loot. Always take free loot in Minecraft. Now, obviously, like I explained to you, this phone does come with um, 60, F 60 FPS support on various games. I'm not entirely sure if Minecraft actually has the ability 60 FPS. Um, I think it. I think it's just capped at 30 for Minecraft, especially on on this phone. I think in phones in general, uh, but. Man, everything seems fine. Everything seems super, super clear. At least for me, I'm not having any problems at all here with lag. Usually when you load in a bunch of chunks, this is when things would happen. So you could definitely play this on the max uh, chunks if you really wanted to. Like, you don't even have to play on the chunks that I have it on. That simply probably would not, not even be needed. So something I do want to mention here is that the processor is a Kirin 980 which I believe is the latest and most powerful chipset available for Huawei. Now it comes with a GPU turbo of 3.0 and technology that utilizes machine learning to optimize graphics and energy management performance when playing games. The phone isn't that hot, it really isn't. And we know this version of Minecraft being Minecraft Bedrock, man, this game really isn't fully optimized, but the phone is dealing with it very well. And I've been messing around with this phone for a couple of hours now throughout today's uh, recording. And I'll tell you one thing, the battery life on this thing is absolutely fantastic. But this is the first gameplay, so let's switch to a different game. So pretty obvious, we've moved over to Fortnite. I haven't played this game for about one year, so pretty proud of myself for getting three kills in this gameplay clip. Now the audio you hear is my own microphone. It's not from the inbuilt microphone this time. I wanted to test it on Minecraft. Um, but the gameplay once again recorded with the software that the phone comes with. And I thought while recording it, it might have caused a little bit of lag or the phone would have at least started to heat up. I had none of that problem. Now this phone, as I'm speaking right now, is on 55%. I've had it up to 70% and I've been using it for over an hour and it really has not dropped that much even while playing Minecraft and Fortnite at the same time. Now, great news guys that this phone comes with an exclusive Fortnite skin, which I'm gonna be giving away to you guys. Since I do not religiously play Fortnite anymore, I think it will benefit one of you guys rather than me. So all you need to do to enter the contest for the skin giveaway, leave a comment down below in the comment section and all you need to type is Honor 20 Pro, that's it. Anybody who leaves a comment with that will be entered and after seven to 10 days, I will pick myself one winner. But yeah, the gameplay is flawless and I'm quite happy with this. So guys, that's my review of the Honor 20. Maybe I should start doing a couple more reviews of phones on this YouTube channel. Uh, the phone is brilliant. I like the fact that it comes with protective cover. I like the fact that it's bigger 
Like I said earlier on in this video, I never realized how much I really appreciate a bigger phone. It's definitely something I will always consider going forward now, but I can use this for gaming, for my daily use. Last thing I want to share with you is these three pictures. Guys, have a great day. The link's down below, and make sure you enter the Fortnite skin giveaway. Of course, catch you next time. Bye!